<laughs> no, not the dee 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 dee. It's bloody raining already. And it's right on my doorstep. Let's go. Morning. Welcome back to the channel. Well, this isn't the walk I had planned for today. Um, different walk, local again. Um, I was going further afield, and so my car decided to give me uh, an engine management light. It's never a good idea to drive distance on those, so today. I'm starting in West Kirby. I'm gonna go up to something called Grange Hill. <laughs> no, not the dee 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 dee. There'll be no Zamo or Tucker. There'll be no other references young people don't get. But top of Grange Hill, there is a rather large war memorial. It's quite impressive. What's also impressive from up in Grange Hill is the views over the Dee and the Wirral. They're really impressive. So, up to Grange Hill, along to see something called the Mariner's Column, or the Mariner's Beacon. More amazing views over the Dee, and up to Wales, and then down the hill, around the marine lake and then I'm gonna mosey on down the Wirral coastal path. It's gonna take about 10 miles to get back home because I'm lucky that I do have these walks on my doorstep and I can jump the train and within half an hour I'm in places like this. So yeah Little coastal path, marine lake, red rocks with views out to Hillbury, the Irish Sea, and then around red rocks down into Hoy Lake and just keep going. No map reading really needed. Keep the sea to your left, Mike, keep the land to your right, just keep going, and you get there. So, I've started, the weather is probably going to turn, so I might get wet, but the beauty of these walks is you're never far away from a pub. we forget. hours early. It's bloody raining already.
we're in West Kirby. We're now looking out. There's Hilbury Island over there. Now, you can walk to Hilbury Island from here. Check the tides. It is tidal. People do get stuck and need rescuing. So don't be that guy. You can walk and if you check the tides and you've got the right footwear on because people still try and do it in trainers, you can head out that way to Little Eye first and get some cracking views over Wales. And then it, it just looks like a beach but it, it can be boggy. And you go out to Middle Eye very little there but still great views and then you move on to the, the big island and the views from there are absolutely amazing but if you time it wrong take food take warm clothes because you're going to be stuck there for about six hours i think so it's a really cracking walk it really is just check the tides wear the right boots and go and see hillby island it's amazing walking now the other side of those dunes is the Royal Liverpool Golf Club the home of the open well, at least it was Hazard, I guess, why they're called Red Rocks.
absolutely gorgeous. And it's right on my doorstep.